Hey what is up guys my name is Eric and welcome to yet another tutorial. Today I'm going to be showing guys how to increase visibility through the use of an external program uh, that increases vibrance within your game. Uh, the program is called the Vibrance GUI. The link will be down in the description below and all it does is as I said increase saturation or vibrance within a game and you can easy, easily control it for which games you want it to um, have an effect on and how much. So I personally use it for Valorant and Apex Legends, uh, but this will work on any game and it's not bannable. So it's safe to use and it's very easy to download and use. So let me show you what the program itself looks like. You can either have it so that it permanently increases the vibrance level of every single program you're running, or as I've done, I have made exceptions for each game I want the effect to be on. So basically, if you want to add a new game, all you have to do is open it up, press an add, and then have the game running and it will show up in the processes section. Um, so I have Valorant running right now. And then you can change the vibrance level that you want for that specific game. You can also change the resolution. So if you want to have 4x3 uh, without the leather boxing on the sides, um, then you can do that through this. Once you've enabled it, and you've got the game running, you might need to restart the game or you might need to open the game up and then close it down. But at the moment, it's at 80% vibrance. And let's see here, if I go back to 50%, which is the normal, you should be able to see a difference within the vibrance level. And now let's change it to 100, which to me is a bit too much, but for some people that might be what they're after. And you can clearly see that an effect has been had on the game but yeah that's it thanks very much for watching hopefully this tutorial was helpful for you if it was please click the like button down below as it helps me out a lot if you have any questions or suggestions for the future videos or whatever then leave those in the comment section down below and as always don't forget to subscribe